Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Electrotech. In today's video, I'm going to be just showing off the mobile support added to the game. And if you're new here, then all you have to do is go and check out the link in the description. And it will show you a guide of how to get started in Lumber Tycoon 2 for all you new people who play on mobile only. Anyways, quick disclaimer that the visuals are kind of bad. That's not, there's really nothing I could do about it. It just, the phone is kind of bad in terms of quality especially when it gets transferred to multiple devices so please just try to ignore that it's a little bit blurry and a little bit disordered anyways let's get right into the video hello everyone welcome to the video if you don't know some things are a little bit different here for example you see i have a little joystick there and a little jump button there that's because I am playing Lumber Tycoon 2 on mobile. That's right, mobile support has been added to the game for real. So it's here to stay. It's not going anywhere. So GG, we're now going to be able to play on our phone. So in today's video, I'm just going to be checking out some features, making sure everything still works on mobile, and then trying a little bit of some daring stunts and maybe some building in the end. Uh, let's get started. Okay, so the base loading animation was the same, I just didn't show it because my screen recorder isn't working too well. Anyways, um, as you can see, oh, uh, let's ignore that. Uh, um, as you can see, the player detector here, it still works. Mm, maybe. Okay, yeah, basically it still works. I just had a little loading issue. But yeah, the player detector still works, which is really good. I'm also noticing that you automatically jump when you get up to a wall, which... Uh, maybe mm, I don't really like that too much but um, as you can see everything's looking pretty much like desktop version except it's on mobile but um, uh, everything should be the same uh, there is one cool feature though that I've discovered with your axes so you could have to hit this drop button here to drop your axe and then you point you use your finger to point on the axe and then you can hit grab and now it will forever stay with you wherever your finger moves it to which is kind of cool and then if you want to drop it there's the drop key right there but there is one cool feature so let's zoom in for this one so if you hold down the rotate key and move your joystick it will actually rotate the axe or you know whatever item you're wanting to rotate so uh, yeah i am um, that that's pretty cool and then you can just hit drop to get rid of it or you could hit pick up the maniacs and now you will pick it back up so basically all the same as you see you can select your blueprints you can get a blueprint you can rotate it and turn it by pressing those buttons you can place it like so and then let's grab a piece of this wood here let's go grab and now uh, you just bring it into here and there's a little bug where if you still have it you have to hit rotate or you have to hit drop to get rid of that little there's like the, the still the UI even though the item's already in the eh, whatever. Just a little bug. Probably get fixed soon, but yeah, I can just delete that. And you know what? Let's try building something. But you know, to build something, you kind of need some wood. So let's go and get some birch wood. Okay, so another cool thing is that if you have your axe here, all you have to do is click the wood to chop it down. And I recommend using an axe that takes the least amount of hits because it's kind of hard to spam click an end times axe. So, just a little warning for you guys. Okay, so I was going to go down and drop off this white wood, but let's just do it right now. Uh, I really want to see if I can drive out this volcano alive. So, um, uh, oh my god, it's so difficult to drive with your thumb because your sensitivity is so high no 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 ah oh my god uh, uh oh there's lots of boulders there's lots of boulder ah oh ah ah oh no there goes the white wood we, we don't have time for the white wood come on come on go 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 no 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 uh, run 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 Ah, uh, go, 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 oh. go, <sighs> oh, oh, no, 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 okay, okay, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, and, oh, we made it, ah, oh, let's go, <laughs> whew, that was pretty intense driving right there, so, you should, you should definitely leave a like on this video for my, my intense 
intense driving, but you know what? I came up here just so that I could go right back down because, ah, uh, let's see if we can make it to the swamp. Uh, I'm stuck. Uh, so I think the blueprint glitch still works. You have to, like, click where you want the blueprint, like that, and then turn. Yay! Yay! It still works. Let's go. That's pretty good. Oh, no. I was so close. I just had that one last ledge, but... It's okay, because now we have time to test out some other glow. And I, whoa, I just realized there's like a lot of stars in the sky. That, that look, I don't know. <laughs> Anyways, let's go and see if the wall glitch still works. So let's grab our trusty little maniac and chop and chop. And now we just take the wood. And yeah, I don't think it works anymore because, yeah, I don't think it works. Let's try it again. So get the mouse right. The angling your player is really difficult in mobile. Um, why isn't there? Oh, oh, so yeah, I'm trying to scroll out right now. Um, okay, let's grab that. Grab. Oh, no, no, I don't, I don't necessarily think it works anymore. <laughs> Or at least in mobile. I'm not sure in desktop, but it definitely, yeah, it doesn't work in mobile. So we're going to have to figure out a new glitch for how to get up places. And with this, I'd assume that the glass pane glitch also probably doesn't necessarily work. Uh, well, now we have a long walk home. Okay, so as I proceed to walk back to my base, I just want to bring up the huge opportunity that playing on mobile brings. For example, I can now make videos on the toilet. Now, this may not seem that good, but oh my god, do you know how much time I spend on the toilet? Oh wow, I'm gonna be able to record videos and be on the toilet at the same time. This, thank you Defaultio so much, you are amazing. This is definitely the best update by far. Okay, so now let's try to do some building. So, um, we got a table. Let's look for, okay, let's get some chairs. It is quite hard to see blueprints at night on mobile because, like, you can see your face in the, in the shadow and it's, it's kind of annoying, but it's, it's doable. There, we got first chair, we got second, uh, okay, well... There we go. I guess now it's time we probably should grab some wood. Uh, we have some oak wood here. So let's do some building. Like, this is one of the first things that I've built ever on mobile. And by the way, I am on the toilet if you are wondering. But um, <laughs> yeah, anyways, let's just, just build this. Build that. And let's grab another piece of wood. And there, it's totally like, this is an Aquaflow level build right here. This is like the, the blocksies of building. Like, th this is amazing. And wait a second. Uh, this wouldn't be a good Electrotech video without some TNT. So, um, ooh. <laughs> um, so, uh, let's, let's drop our axes real quick. Because I don't really want to explode them or anything you know so let's now bring bring this back um can you can you stay tnt thank you okay let's bring it over here and i think we can detonate it and then explode it yep okay well anyways thank you all so so much for watching this video again if you're new check out my guide in the link below and i'm gonna explode it. yeah i'm dead okay well uh roll the end screen goodbye